Today on MC Sports, it's Team Oliver and, and Team Oliver against Adam and the Cool Kids. It's Team A, the Cool Kids, against Team B, Team Oliver. Coming up next on MC Sports. What? Oh, okay, never mind. Good mor good morning everyone. I'm Garen and welcome to the M Media Center in Palo Alto parking lot. And joining me today is Teddy. To give an in depth of analysis. Today we have a great matchup between Team A, the cool kids against Team B, the Team Oliver. And welcome oh, yeah, my. Any initial thoughts? Um, I really think the cool kids are going to take this one. They may not have the height advantage, but I think Adam is a really talented player, and Sarah Nash has really been upping her game recently, so I think they'll be able to take out the W. Okay. And Got the opening tip-off coming up next, right after this, on MC Sport. What's that? That was okay, right? Welcome back to the MC Media Center parking lot in Palo Alto. Looks like teams are getting ready to start here. Yep. Who do you think is going to win this game? I think uh, also your prediction might be right. Sarah has upped her game on the cool kids. And the early shot from Oliver is just missed. And Sarah with the rebound. Oliver. Oh. Oh. Oh, Sarah for two. Miss. And it's the cool kid's ball. It's odd to see Sarah Bennett taking jump shots like that. You'd really expect her to take advantage of her height advantage, bring it in the post, and just put it up from right underneath the basket. Mm-hmm. Now, Sarah checking it to Oliver. Now to Adam. Adam passes it to Sarah. Sarah passes the other Sarah. Adam shoots to the rim. Miss. Rebound by Sarah, and it is in for two by Sarah on the cool kids. Really a lack of hustle by Sarah Bennett there, letting Sarah Nash get underneath her to that rebound. With her height advantage, she should be grabbing that every time. I don't know how she let Sarah Nash get that under. I know, her. right? She. Oh, okay, we're playing by ones or and twos. You don't know the rules of street ball. Who do you think's gonna carry the scoring load for Adam and Sarah here? I think S S Sarah could uh, pull away with the points and uh, make it a uh, a sweep and a uh, game that the team Oliver will not score maybe a couple points, but not a lot. Now it's. Two to zero, right? Adam with the layup. And they're playing loose's ball. Oh, off the rim there by Oliver. Looks like we actually are playing by twos after all. Some normal basketball scoring here. So no, no, up. no, they had one. They had one. They were up four to zero. Yeah. We'll we'll see when our graph turns. And Sorry for the technical now we're playing by twos. There we go. Sarah. Adam dribbling. Against Sarah Bennett, to Adam goes to the basket, and it's missed by Adam and Oliver with the ball. Oliver has a wide open shot, doesn't take it. Yep. Oliver passed Sarah Nash, and it is in for two by Oliver with the layup. Wow, that was poor defense there by by the cool kids. Yeah, poor defense by the cool kids, but a really smart play by Oliver. He had an open jump shot, but he passed it up for the higher percentage look right underneath. 
out there or the ball passes it to Adam. Adam dribbling, dribble around the court. Now back to the left hand, passes it to Sarah, but is intercepted by Oliver. What a, what a, uh, interception by Oliver and blocked by Adam. Did that go in? No, it didn't, I don't think. I think that was great defense by Adam to recover. Get his hand in between Sarah Bennett and the basket. Stop the ball going in. Now Sarah back to Adam. Sarah Bennett guarding. Adam. All through the legs. Not enough to get the ball through the legs of Sarah Bennett. Oh, passes to Oliver. Oliver open line. It is in a tied. Four to four. Oh, now Team, team Oliver just scored four straight points. The cool kids really need to close out on Oliver there. He can make those shots, and he will punish you if you leave him open. They can't be leaving Adam him open. Adam passes it to Sarah. Sarah wide open, shoots it. It is no good. And Sarah Bennett passes, pa passes it to Oliver. O Sarah Ness guarding. Oliver, fade away. It is, is it good? No. It is wide. He just missed. I can't really see. It's in Do we have a director? So we've got a close game still here. Oliver. Oh. Oh, Oliver again. He's on fire. He's just, ladies and gentlemen, Team Oliver just got six points in a row to take the lead, six to four. Oliver with a great game so far. You wonder if the cool kids are going to want to switch their defensive strategy. Thanks. Oliver is getting open easily. Maybe they should be double teaming him. Sarah Bennett just doesn't seem like an offensive threat. They could afford to leave her open. Sarah is a good defense. Sarah Bennett is and a defensive threat too. Some guard and Adam misses it. A wide open shot. Oliver now he made it. Right. No, I think he, he was it. just just far. On that jump shot. It's angle. It's angle. <laughs> um, it's four to four here. Yeah, it's four to four. Sarah Banks went in there. And now it's six to four, cool kid. They're just taking the scoring right now. Yeah, both teams have only had one of their and players scoring. Sarah barely missed the. She was so close to scoring her first points of the game there. Okay, here we've got Adam on the side. Hello, hello. Here's Adam with the ball now. Sarah guarding. Uh, Sarah Bennett guarding Adam. Sh Adam shoots it and just near the... Oh, great pass there by Oliver. And it is in for two points. Teddy, what about that pass? I think that was really a great pass by Oliver. He knows he's the primary scoring option, so they're looking to defend him. And he and uses that to feed his teammate, also Sarah Also, that Bennett. was a great find from Oliver and a great run there by Sarah. Another pass there from Sarah, and it is in again. Ten to four. Team Oliver just scored ten points to right. Wow, they're really going on a run here. I don't know if... Sarah and Adam have anything in their locker to change the momentum. It might just be over already, folks. Now, Adam. Sarah Bennett guarding Adam. Adam to the rim. It is missed. That should have gone in, ladies and gentlemen. All of her from two. God, you normally see Adam make those. It. No, I don't think that went in. I think he just missed off the back rim there. But it's odd. You normally see Adam make layups like that. I wonder if he really is shook, shook by getting scored 10 points in a row on him.
Sarah? Cool. Sarah shoots it. It is no good. That's really not Sarah's yeah. game there. Sarah I wonder why she's shooting that. Oliver. Oliver makes it two. And it is 12 to four, ladies and gentlemen. Team Oliver has gone on a 12 and 0 run to take an eight point lead and a 12 4 lead. Looks like Sarah is calling a timeout here. They really need to do something to stop the bleeding. They just can't stop Oliver right now. They're talking it over. We'll see if they have a new strategy coming out of this timeout. Something that will allow them to I stop Oliver. I think they Oliver. were talking about, uh, they might have just switched guarding. Now Sarah, mi Sarah might have the ball guarding Sarah. Oh, no, they didn't switch. Adam shoots it, passes it to Sarah. Sarah the shot just wide off the backboard. Now they change. Is Sarah with the pass to Oliver? Oh, back to Sarah. Oh, it gets away from Sarah. And it is out of bounds for a cool kid ball. Let's that see. might have been a that was a good pass there from Oliver, but it just slipped through the hands of Sarah Bennett. Now pa Sa Sarah Nash passes it to Adam. Adam dribbling. Passes it to Sarah Nash. Shoots it. Big shoots it. Adam to the rim. It is off the rim and out. And Adam has the ball, passes it to Sarah. Sarah shoots off the rim again, back to Adam again. And Adam makes it. Great hustle by Adam, getting those offensive rebounds for second and third chance opportunities, eventually puts it in the basket. Now Sarah Bennett passes it to Oliver. Oliver wide open shot, and he takes it. 12 to 14 to 6, Oliver, Team Oliver with the lead by 8 and a 12 and a 14-6 lead. You just got to feel bad for the cool kids here. The first time they start to put together some offense, looks like they might be able to turn this game around. Oliver just comes back, sinks another dagger into their chest. Adam in. Takes an eight-point lead. Adam gets the rebound again. Great hustle there by Adam. Oh, what a hustle there. And with the steal by Sa And Adam to the rim. Ooh, that was a poke in the eyes to Oliver. And he looks like he's hurt, ladies and gentlemen. Ooh. You hate to see that. Oliver's been having perhaps the game of his career out here, scoring bucket after bucket. You really hope he shakes it off, comes back okay. And Sarah Benner has not been scoring a lot. Why should Adam guard him? be guarding Sarah to be Sarah? Oliver to the rim, mate. Shoots in, men makes it in. 14, 16, 6. Wow, Oliver is just unstoppable today. Even after his injury, he shakes it off instantly, comes back, puts it in the hoop. Adam shoots it. It is off the rim. Now Sarah Nash has it with the great rebound. And poor... Poor guarding there by Sarah Bennett. Adam, sh Sarah shoots it off the rim, and Oliver gets the rebound. Now Sarah passes it to Oliver. Oliver shoots a th Ooh. three, but it's offline, and Sarah Nash with the rebound. That's Oliver's first miss in like his last six shots. He's just been on a tear recently. Oh, tries to keep it in, but it's Oliver shoots it, and no good. And Adam makes, Adam has the ball. Go ahead. No. Here we go. Adam passes it to Sarah. Oh, Sarah right past Oliver and in. Now a cool kids cut the deficit to eight. And just a great pass there by Adam. And a great run there by Sarah to Sarah Nats to score that. Nice to see the... Oh, oh my, my God. Oh, my God. Oliver for three. Even as I say that it's nice to see them get some momentum back, Oliver just does Things it again. Three. He can't be stopped today. The cool kids have nothing on Oliver. They're never going to get back in this game. It's just a matter of time. Now Sarah Nat passes it to Adam. Adam.
Adam dribbling around to the rim. Oh, Adam just missed, and Adam gets great hustle there by Adam to get the rebound over Oliver. I think we're playing 21 here, so you know, it makes sense Adam's hustling for that rebound. If they let the other team get the ball back, Oliver will probably put in another two Sarah and finish it. the Adam game off. The rebound. And great rebound there by Adam to get the tap in, and now the deficit is to nine. Cool Kids 10, Team Oliver 19. Cool Kids have to play defense here. This is for Sarah the game. Bennett, this is for the game. Passes it to Oliver. Now to Sarah for the game. Oliver right open three. Blocked there by Adam. And Sarah with the rebound. Adam, Cookies are getting some momentum back. Adam and Sarah finally on the last, potentially last possession of the game, locked down on Oliver. Don't let him get his jump shot off. First time they've been able to do that all game. They'll have to keep that up for about five straight possessions here if, if they, they want, want any chance of coming back. I well, don't think Sarah they have nice. it in them. I think eventually Oliver will get Sarah open Nash to finish the game. Adam. Adam near the rim passes it to Sarah Nash. Oliver Garden. Sarah Nash fake shoots it, passes to Adam. Adam to the rim, passes it to Sarah, Sarah shoots it, it is off the rim. And Adam hustles, great hustle there by Adam to get the rebound. Oh, it is off and Adam gets the rebound. This could be the last possession. Sarah Nash visibly frustrated there Sarah, as once again Oliver her shot doesn't game. go in. Net misses it for the game. Oliver, three, no off the line again. It's clear. Oliver and Sarah Bennett know who their star player is. Sarah Bennett is just feeding Oliver to take this game-winning shot. And he wants that pressure. He thrives in it. Pretty soon, I think he's going to make this game winner. It is 19-10 to 10 with a uh, Team Oliver lead. Now, Sarah. Seems to be some confusion over whose ball it is. Okay, now here we go. Cool kids Sarah. have it. Cool kids have it. Sarah, Sarah Nash passes, all pa passes it to Adam. Adam. Sarah. Okay. Now Sarah Bennett steals it there from Adam. Oliver shoots it for the game. Oh. Off the rim. Sarah Bennett for the win. Oh, just missed off the backboard. And Adam with the rebound. Wow, this game has been going on longer than it looked like it would earlier when it was 19 to 8 Adam, and Oliver Sarah was Nash on passes fire. To Adam. There seems to be no momentum from both teams in the last two minutes. Sarah shoots it. Three, and she drains it. Honestly. Oh, timeout, Adam says. A bit surprising to see Sarah Nash celebrating like that when. They're on game point, about to lose the game. Seems a bit cocky to me if you're down seven, about to lose, and you're celebrating like that. And they just called a timeout here. I don't want the water. We'll see if this water break allows them to get back in the game, but I don't think so. I think it's just a matter of time before Team Oliver puts the final nail in the coffin and finishes it off. Oh, guys, it's the end of the uh, the first half, and all Team Oliver with the lead 19 to 10. Yep, it's been a good game so far. Team Oliver has really been pretty dominant up until this time out. Uh, how do you, how do you think the game's going to go? Do you think they could uh, come back in the second half, maybe? Uh, I really don't think cool the cool kids will be able to come back. I think. Oliver has been too dominant. Sarah Bennett has been a defensive force as always. And Sarah Nash and Adam really just haven't been able to put it in the bat, but, 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 God, in the hoop like they normally are. Who do you think has been the best player in the whole game so far? I don't think that's even a question. I think it has to be Oliver. He made he, like six shots in a row at one point. He hasn't the, been stopped. And, and the cool kids are not stopping Oliver. And now if they... If Team Oliver gets two more points, they win the game. Yep, I really think those two points are really inevitable at this point. Sarah Nash looks done. She's checking her phone, even here during a timeout. She does not look like she's ready to come back out and 
win 10 straight points in order to send this game into overtime. And, uh, do you, th do you think that Sarah Bennett has been playing very well defense, or do you think it's it's that uh, cool kids haven't been scoring well? I think it's a little over here, a little over there. I think Sarah Bennett and Oliver have both are both great defensive players, especially Sarah Bennett. She's a defensive specialist, and they've been doing their job. But honestly, I think they've given up some opportunities that in a normal game, Adam and Sarah Nash would make. They're just not hitting their shots today. I don't know what it is. Maybe they woke up on the wrong side of the bed. Maybe they were out too late at the club last night, but they're just not putting it away. Do you think uh, Sarah Bennett, Sarah, uh, Sarah Nash could do better than this? I, I definitely think so. I think she's been missing shots she normally makes. And if she keeps this up, they're going to lose. But if she turns it around in the second half, then maybe they have a chance. Okay. And now back after the second half, they just took a time out there, and looks like we're about to get underway soon here. We'll see who can finish it off. Whether it will be Team Oliver, which looks inevitable at this point, but you never know. The cool kids still have a chance. It ain't over till the fat lady things. Is Sarah Bennett? Why doesn't she put that up? That's a game-winning opportunity right there. You just need one basket. Oh, Sarah, pass it. Oh, great steal there by all. Uh, was, Teddy, was it just a poor pass, or was it great defending by uh, Adam there? Honestly, I think that was just great defense. Adam has got quick hands, quick feet. He stays in between his man and the ball, and, and he, read he reaches the, out. He, he read the ball very well. He knew a uh, pass was going to go to Oliver because Oliver has been on fire. Exactly. I think now, everyone knows that Adam Team Oliver wants to Oliver Nash. to take that final shot, and Adam's that, taking advantage of that. Now, say, oh, great move there by Adam. Tried to be in Sarah Bennett. Passes it to Sarah Nash. Nash passes it to Adam. Adam passes it to Sarah Nash. Sarah shoots it. It is in. Sarah Nash just scored four straight buckets. Oh, it looks like that Five was even a three. Buckets. She was behind the line there. They're coming back. She's celebrating. Their momentum's on the rise. They might actually have a chance in this one. Oliver I know. hasn't doing, been well for the last three minutes. Yeah. And now Sarah Bennett. Oh, going to the rim for the game. It is. And the game is over. Team Oliver with the win. And the cool kids cannot get all the momentum back. Even... And even as we speak, saying that the cool kids might have a chance, the game winner comes from an unexpected source, Sarah Bennett, scoring and finishing off this game, 21-15 to for Team Oliver. Our final score is Team Oliver 21 and the cool kids 15. We want to thank our entire MC Sports student crew. Our next broadcast will be in a, in a few minutes. For my for my broadcast partner, Teddy. I'm I'm Garian, and this has been a a student sports production of Mid Penn Media Center. Have a great night.